Who do you call when you're a dictator fighting a brutal war? Ramzan Kadyrov and his Chechen special forces. Join us at the battlefront to explore who are the world notorious Kadyrovtsi. Born from the ashes of the Chechen wars, the Kadyrovtsi originated as a separatist militia battling against the Russian state. In a bid to divide the enemy, Moscow quoted their leader, Ahmad Kadyrov, to defect, fight his former allies, and take on the region's jihadist insurgents. Following the elder Kadyrov's demise in a terror attack, control of the group was inherited by his son, Ramzan Kadyrov. The flamboyant but violent princeling became a social media celebrity mocked as a TikTok warrior for posting combat videos while safely away from the front. His social media obsession revealed a love of wildlife, high-caliber weapons, and kids' MMA fights. Kadyrov followed his father as president of the Chechen Republic and integrated his militia into the security services' motorized regiments, anti-terrorism units, and Spetsnaz Special Forces. Estimated in the tens of thousands, the army pacified Chechnya by force, earning a brutal rat. The Kadyrovtsi carry badges, but many of them have criminal pasts. Human rights groups claim they travel by night as execution squads, disappearing civilians to cement their clan rule. Ramzan is rumored to own a private prison and torture chamber in Sentoroi, south of Grozny. Kadyrov launched an anti-gay purge rife with abductions, imprisonments, and extrajudicial slayings. The social media warlord denies even the existence of gay men in Chechnya. They have also been accused of gangsterism and enriching themselves from illegal oil trading. The Kadyrovtsi go around the world to support Moscow's foreign policy, fighting in the Syrian civil war and supporting counterterrorism operations in China's Uyghur majority Xinjiang region. Kadyrov deployed his merciless troops in the Russia-Ukraine war. The Chechens were given enemy lists printed on playing cards with the mission to liquidate the country's leadership. The infamous paramilitaries were deployed as a psychological weapon against the people of Ukraine. Reports suggest the Chechens are used as barrier troops to execute deserters. They also fought in the siege of Mariupol against their bitter enemies, the far-right Azov Battalion. Playing the warlord, Kadyrov urged Moscow to unleash his men for a decisive assault against Ukraine. But their poor fighting performance and lack of discipline signal a different outcome. Reputation isn't everything. Known for bluster and brutality, the Kadyrovtsi proved better at propaganda than battle. The group reportedly suffered heavy casualties and failed to reach their war objectives in Ukraine, eroding their manicured image as an elite fighting force. But the Kadyrovtsi's usefulness isn't as warriors, but as bogeymen. Weapons of Psychological Terror For more notorious gunmen and outlaws, check out Geonected's growing playlist on the world's most dangerous paramilitaries.